Have you ever saved an edit to an image that you didn't mean to? Well, if you're using Lightroom Classic, you don't need to worry about it. Welcome to the Visual Center, I'm Trent. And in today's post-production tips, we're going to look at how Lightroom Classic works, including how it keeps our original images safe from destruction, or destruction, however you want to say it. So be sure to subscribe so you can follow along as we lift the hood and take a deep dive into Lightroom Classic with these short post-production tips videos. Also, you won't want to miss out in the future as we take a look at other software. All right, let's get back to Lightroom Classic. Lightroom Classic is a catalog-based system. Now, what does this mean? A catalog system works by referencing a file. For us, it would be our original raw images, the ones we download from our cameras or memory cards. Now, there are two main components. The original image, which we captured with our cameras, hopefully these are raw images, and a preview or a copy of that original image, which is created by Lightroom Classic. So how does this work? In order to use Lightroom Classic to edit our images, we need to first import those images. So first we need to connect our camera or our memory card to our computer. And now we can use the software to import the images. Now two things are going to happen when we import those images. First, Lightroom Classic is going to copy the raw image to a location we choose. And second, it's going to create a preview image or a copy of that raw image for the software to use. Now once that preview image is in Lightroom Classic, we can now use the software to view, organize, and edit our images. The best thing about this system is the fact that the raw image isn't touched. So as we're editing our images, we can't save over the raw accidentally so the raw image is protected. Now as soon as we're ready to export our final image, Lightroom is going to take the raw full resolution data from the raw image and combine it with the edits we've made to the preview image and it will export it as a new image, a JPEG, PSD, TIFF, whatever we want to export it as. And now it will be outside the software and we can use it to post to social media, to email, to, give, to deliver to a client, whatever we want to do with it. So this is what is meant when someone says Lightroom is a catalog-based system, and this is how it works. The most important advantage of this system is the fact that the original images are never touched. The original raw images are safe from being mistakenly edited or ruined. The images are protected. Now, efficiency is also an important advantage. Image previews, or the copies, can be much faster to organize and edit since we're using reference images. So, the important things to remember are that when we import images into Lightroom Classic, we save the original images, again, hopefully raw, in a certain location, and then Lightroom will create previews of those images and for us to organize and edit. Now this protects our original images and creates a much faster environment to work in. All right, that's it for today's post-production tips. Let us know if you have any questions in the comments below or if you have any requests on what you'd like to see in the future. Now thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.